क्वेश्चन नंबर थर्टी फोर इज अल नोन आइडेंटिटी ए क्रॉस बी बी क्रॉस सी सी क्रॉस ए का बॉक्स इक्वल्स ए बी सी के बॉक्स का स्क्वायर सो वी कैन डायरेक्टली कैलकुलेट द वैल्यू ऑफ लैंड एज वन बट इफ वी आर ओपनिंग दिस दिस इज गोइंग टू बी ए क्रॉस बी डॉट बी क्रॉस सी क्रॉस सी क्रॉस ए एंड अकॉर्डिंग टू वेक्टर ट्रिपल प्रोडक्ट वी कैन राइट दिस एक्सप्रेशन एज B cross C dot A that is BC ka box then is C vector minus then is B cross C dot C that is the box of BCC that is going to be zero and now BC ka box we all know is ABC ka box and this is A cross B dot C so this is going to be ABC ka box ka square and from here lambda is equal to one and hence the correct answer is question number thirty five. In this question, we have to find the variance of first fifty even natural numbers. Question number thirty-five. First fifty even natural numbers means two, four, six, eight, and so on up to hundred. Now to find variance, the formula of variance is variance is equal to sigma x k square upon n minus sigma x k upon n whole square. So first we have to find out sigma x k square, which means four plus sixteen plus thirty six and so on hundred square, which becomes four into fifty fifty one one zero one upon six, which becomes three four three four into fifty. Now to find its average. Sigma x k square upon fifty, which is three four three four. This is our first part. Now to find sigma x k upon n whole square, this becomes one two plus four plus six and so on up to hundred whole divided by fifty whole square, which becomes two six zero one. So our final answer is variance is equal to 3434 minus 2601 which is 833 so our correct option is option number second now our next question is question number 36 this question is based upon heights and distances a bird is sitting on the top of a vertical pole 20 meter high bird is sitting on the top of the vertical pole and its elevation from a point o on the ground level is 45 degree this means this angle is 45 degree it flies off horizontally straight away from the point o it means bird flew in this direction after 1 second the elevation of the bird from o is reduced to 30 degree means this angle becomes 30 degree then we have to find out speed of the bird if we draw perpendicular from this point and extend this line up to that point assume this point as a and b if this complete angle is 45 this implies oa is equal to ab which is 20 now if we consider this point as c and d And apply tan rule in triangle OCD. Tan 30 degree is equal to CD upon OD. CD is equal to AB, which is 20 divided by OD. Here we evaluate OD as 20 root 3. The distance AD becomes OD minus OA, which is 20 root 3 minus 20. This implies twenty root three minus one. This distance covered in one second. Hence, the speed of the bird is twenty root three minus one meter per second. Hence, our final answer is option number fourth. Our next question is question number thirty-seven. This question based upon definite integration. We have to evaluate integration zero to pi. Under root of one plus four sine square x by two 
minus 4 sin x by 2 dx. If we examine the expression written inside the under root, this is a, an perfect square which is 2 sin x by 2 minus 1. Now our new question is integration 0 to pi mod of 2 sin x by 2 minus 1. To simplify this question, first we have to assume x by 2 as t means dx upon 2 is equal to dt. Our new question is integration 0 to pi by 2 mod of 2 sin t minus 1 to dt. Now we have to form the cases of mod. Its critical point is sin t is equal to half. So we have to form the cases at sin t is equal to half which means 30 degree. So to integration 0 to pi by 6. Now mod will express as 1 minus 2 sin t dt plus integration pi by 6 to pi by 2 minus 2 sin t minus 1 dt. Now this is simple integration 2 times this becomes t plus 2 sin t 0 to pi by 6 plus minus 2 cos t minus t pi by 6 to pi by 2. By putting the values pi by 6 and 0 as well as pi by 2 and pi by 6, we get the final answer as 4 root 3 minus 4 minus pi by 3. This implies our option number 4th is correct.